I don't know how to turn it off. Robbie. Robbie? Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, I was studying how to make a, a battery from, from a lemon and, well, uh, how do I say this? I accidentally time traveled? <laughs> Right, and what materials were used for your project? Um, lemon, nickels, copper wires, LED lights, uh, the space-time continuum, and... <laughs> Wait a minute. What year is it? <laughs> when am I? Okay, <laughs> that's enough of that. Tell me about the proposed materials you used for your hypothesis. My independent variable was the music. Mozart, of course. <laughs> I dropped a piece of candy in each 12-ounce bottle of soda. Um, I went to the Wild West and got chased by a thousand buffalo. One of them ripped my pants. <laughs> okay, Robbie, we're talking about hypothesis. Oh. Well, if Romans wear sandals, then they shouldn't be able to run very fast. But they sure did. <laughs> I got chased by a hundred of them. Okay, Robbie. <laughs> did anyone else jump through time? No. I just got soda all over my kitchen. My mom got really mad. <laughs> Your mommy got mad at you. I'm so sorry. Napoleon yelled at me! <laughs> okay, let's move on to conclusions. Not surprisingly, the plants that were playing classical music grew the most. I found out that men tells me the biggest soda volcano. Well, there is no soda in the future because soda got replaced by Blorzo juice, which is actually a pill. They had ads on all the flying buses. And in the future, that haircut is actually popular. Okay, I feel like we're getting a little off topic from the lemon bath. Oh, you're telling me? I was just trying to make an electrical circuit with paper clips and lemons, and the next thing you know, I'm running from a T-Rex. Heck yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, the future people put a chip behind my eyelids that plays movies whenever it wants. They made me watch 87 Adam Sandler movies. In a row. I don't know how to turn it off. Okay, back to the science fair, everyone. Oh, I win the science fair too, I saw that part. Aw, oh, man! Really, really, Robbie, you think you're gonna win the science fair with this lemon thing? I knew that was gonna happen. Oh. We've all been there. You have a new phone and it's lame. You never want people to think you care about your most expensive items. That's why we're here. Wait, where am I? Welcome to the Crack Your Phone store where we crack your phone for you. Come on. When you visit us at the Crack Your Phone store, you're gonna get so much more than a cracked phone. Your phone will be so cracked, you'll get glass stuck in your fingers. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Completely distorted photos from both your front and back cameras. Cool! <laughs> and those pesky text messages you didn't want to read? Now I can't! <laughs> Whoa, I want all of those things. Well, you got it, because at the Crack Your Phone store, your crack is in good hands. <laughs> it's just what I wanted. You know it is. <laughs> Choose from a wide variety of cracks, perfected by an advanced team of crack specialists. <laughs> There's our basic crack where we drop your phone from a short distance. <laughs> we can crack it with the racket. You can even take a crack at it yourself with our Crack It Yourself Kit. It's a sledgehammer. Wow, there are so many great options. I don't know how I could possibly choose. But wait, what's that? That's a toilet. You told us that if we wanted something, we had to make a compelling argument. Indeed you did. So, this evening, we've prepared a presentation to convince you, the best parents in the world, that we need uh, a dog. Yeah! Yeah!
a member of our family. <laughs> now I know what you're thinking, but I'm already one step ahead. Next slide! You're probably thinking that a dog would cause you extra stress. Get to the furniture and rip apart your favorite dress. That's my friend! Cannon, baby. Yeah, and welcome to Math Video Game Dancer Celebrity Edition. The only show where celebrities perform dances from your favorite video game to a panel of celebrity judges. Let's meet the panel. Beyonce! Bow down. Ariana Grande? Yeah. And do one. The Rock, Justin! Oh, bring it! Ooh, ah. Let's bring out our first dancer. My name is Appleface, and my dance is called Toothbrush. Brush, baby, brush! <laughs> the only person who can dance that good? Is me, the queen bee. I like it, I want it, I bought it, I got it, yeah. This jabroni is laying the smack down. And time. Ariana said, yeah. Beyonce gets Beyonce and the rock doubled in size. I'm your host, JJ Hawkins, and welcome to Boot Up, where one lucky contestant finds a boot. And by boo, I don't mean date. <laughs> I'll be a ghost. <laughs> Today's lucky lady is a Grammy Award winning artist who likes long walks on the beach and 90s jams. Please welcome Ella Mae. Thanks, JJ. I'm really excited to be here and pick the ghost that's going to haunt my house forever. <laughs> Better your house than mine. Let's meet our contestant. <laughs> the rosy while you're trying to sleep and pushing swings with no one in them. Me! <laughs> Hi, I'm Blanche, and my favorite pastimes are throwing your teacups against the wall and doing this in the middle of the night. tickets this weekend. Wait, what? Yeah. Mama, please! Mama! No, don't take them. Don't take my tickets, Mama, please! I need them! Mama! Amateur. Hey, YouTube, it's Beyonce from All That. Like what you see? Click below to subscribe. Don't forget to like and leave a comment. Uh, bye bye <laughs>